hormone therapy is a treatment that either adds or blocks or removes hormones in your body. In the male, the hormone that we talk about is an androgen or testosterone. And testosterone will affect prostate cancer. Testosterone is produced by the testicles and some by the adrenal gland, but what it does is it stimulates prostate cancer to grow. So one of the basic tenets of treating prostate cancer is to try to get rid of the hormones that stimulate the prostate to grow. So if we can stop prostate growth by blocking testosterone with these hormones that we give, then we can make progress in treating prostate cancer. There are many um, injectable hormones that we use. We can either give it monthly, every three months, every four months, or every, every six months to block the hormones, testosterone, from stimulating the prostate cancer. Hormonal therapy is really not a treatment, a primary treatment for prostate cancer. We use hormonal therapy to, in addition to radiation therapy, or if a patient has had a radical prostatectomy for local disease, and we find that the patients have a PSA that doesn't go to zero, and if that we call that PSA persistence or disease persistence, we may use hormonal therapy for that. If we find that after primary treatment, the PSA goes down, thankfully, but over a period of time, the PSA may start to rise again, and that's called recurrence. And that's another time that we use hormonal therapy. And this will, this will send the PSA back down and put the patient's prostate cancer into remission.